Hey guys, welcome to Tika's Kitchen. Today, I'll walk you through the step of making your lemon flavor beans and rice. First step to that, wash two cups of rice. If but it is white rice, if you want brown rice, wash two cups of rice. For to season my rice, I'm using two packets of the Goya seasoning, saison. I'm using one tablespoon of garlic paste one onion, a medium onion, some cilantro, half teaspoon of paprika, and half teaspoon of turmeric. Salt. Salt, just put as much as you need it for your flavor. For this, I will be using half tablespoon of salt in here. Just add your onion first into the oil. I have some oil in the pot. This is the rice cooker pot that I'll be using. So I have some oil heating up in here. I'll add my onion to that. Okay, keep frying your onions. Add your garlic paste. Add your turmeric and paprika. Keep your stove on a medium heat. Go ahead and add your rice. Add your two packets of saison. Now keep, for me, I just fry this up, let it, let the rice get toasted a little, probably about five minutes, let it keep toasting on the medium heat. This is the secret to my beans and rice. I keep cooking it in the oil here for a little bit with all the season, everything come together nice with the rice. So... You can raise your heat up to six or seven and keep toasting this for about five minutes. Okay, so this is done. This is what you're looking for. You got that brown look into it. Now, remember, every cup of rice is two cups of water. On my um, rice cooker here, I have a measurement, so I put the water all the way up to four on this measurement here. So go ahead and add your water to your rice cooker. Okay, so you got your four cups of water to two cups of rice. Now I add my salt and for the this is when you put your lemon lime or lemon juice so i got two full lime so that's about a full tablespoon and one and a half tablespoon of juice in there stir that up good mix it real good Uh-huh. Now just cover and put it to cook. I am doing white rice, so I'll press white rice and that start cooking. While the rice cooking, I went ahead and prepare my veggies that I'll be using. For me I do half and half. If it's two cups of rice, I want to do even amount of veggies, even more, that's better. So here I have different color of the bell peppers, red, orange, yellow, green. That's about a little over a cup. A cup of cabbage, chopped cabbage. This is the 29 ounce of um, black beans. I'm doing black beans. You need some more onions. 
garlic paste and some black pepper that's all you need for this process so um go ahead and add your garlic and onion to your pan this cup and another thing you don't like you don't want your veggies to be um, overcooked so even your onion let the garlic cook a little and then start putting in first I'll put in the beans so that gets the cook through a little Remember you already packed your rice with a lot of flavors, so you don't need to put all the other stuff here again. Okay, go ahead, add your black beans. Let this cook for a little. Okay, add your cabbage. Beautiful colors of pepper. Mm. I'm so happy. I love seeing all these beautiful vegetables together. I'm at a happy place seeing all this goodness. Okay, let me add my salt in here now. Half tablespoon of salt, you already put half tablespoon in the rice, half tablespoon of salt, and some black pepper, probably about, um, I would say, one teaspoon, oh, half teaspoon, sorry, half teaspoon. Good in here. Put that is there. The rice has two seconds to go. Good timing. Okay, this should stay here probably, I would say, five minutes or less. Don't make your veggie cook too much. Cover it and let it um Okay, let's check on this and see. Ooh. Yes, this is done. You don't want your veggie to cook 
more than the Okay, time to add your rice. Just start adding all your rice in there. Mix it up really well. Let me put it all in there. Okay, so this is done mixing. This looks really beautiful. Look at that. All the nice colors. Time for me to go taste this. cup of rice, some cabbage, a little bit of tomatoes, then some avocados, you need a nice little bit of avocado in there. Some cilantro, and a little bit of lemon juice, just a sprinkle of lemon juice. And there you go. All the goodness in there. Avocado, cabbage, and tomato as your topping on top. Some cilantro. good hope you try this and hope you love it too see you next cooking